Hello and welcome back uh, for Houdini HQ part 3. So uh, we have now an HQ server on Windows uh, with a Houdini license. So now we have to do the same thing but with a Linux machine. So I create my own Linux machine uh, that will be a, a slave computer. It will be responsible for render some tasks. And uh, now I will just install Houdini on this uh, on this computer. So I will uh, download the Houdini package from the website, unzipped the package, and now I will just launch a terminal. I will add it at favorite. Yes, like that. It should be uh, easier for me. Um, I just do right click. I will say I want to open in terminal directly from this folder so that will be easier and faster and now we are inside so um, I will just take a look on what we have inside the folder so uh, you have the install file uh, it is just a text uh, text file that contains uh, the explanation to install Houdini um, I will just launch this the Houdini install there. So I just write sudo because I, ha I have to do it as a root. Houdini install and let's go. So just write my password. I, w I have to read the license agreement. Not pretty long, so space, 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 space again. And I will say, yes, I'm agree. So, we will install Houdini. You see there's a yes on the line one. Yes for the line two. Um, we have to uh, to install uh, in the same time not the HQ server but the HQ client. The HQ server is already installed on one machine. That's sufficient. That's enough. But to activate the HQ client installation, I just have to read uh, the number. It is eleven. I will type eleven. Enter. So now the HQ client is okay. I will click. Uh, I will just type half. As finished so uh, would you like to start the installation yes so the installation is on its way so next step now uh, we'll uh, install the HQ client and uh, in this case uh, it will ask you to create a, a user for that so uh, don't create an HQ user use your uh, administrator profile that will be easier to control everything so uh, just uh, write my name profile where do you want to install the HQ client use the same folder you will see it will be in my home uh, which HQ server we will configure this later and that's uh, on installation So if I want to uh, configure the share folder, not yet. Uh, I will prefer to uh, configure uh, everything after just to understand where everything is on uh, the computer and how you will be able to change this. And uh, now this is complete. Uh, if I take a look on my uh, menu you will see there's a side effect software so last step we just have to configure uh, the license server so i just launch the license administrator i will have to use my side effects as my license server yes I will have to log me. So for that, I will use my login on the uh, SideFX soft 
at um, on SideFX website. Sometimes on Linux, you will have to change the license server. So for that, just think to remove the local one. In my case, it is Cyril uh, VirtualBox. And I accept this. And you will see there is a, a green checkered. That's good in sign. We just uh, try to uh, launch uh, Houdini. And that's correct. So now Houdini is on your... Uh, Houdini is now on your computer.